Hello dear all welcome to Sunday Education Academy I am Santosh Wal in this video we will see question under try this section page number 123 chapter 8 comparing quantities class 8 mathematics so let's start our video see the question under try this page number 123 comparing quantities class 8 mathematics question is given find the selling price sp if the profit of 5% is made on three situations are given first is a cycle of rupees 700 with rupees 50 as overhead charges and b and c are also given we will first see the a solution for a now what is the given data given data is profit profit is common for all these three so i will write here profit profit is equal to 5% and for the first example 700 is the cost of the cycle but there is rupees 50 overhead charges so cost price cost price for the cycle will be rupees 700 plus overhead charges that will be the rupees 750 and on this rupees 750 He is making five percent profits. See, profit is always on this cost price. So, what will be the profit? Profit will be profit in rupees. Profit in rupees. It is percentage. Five percent is percentage. So, profit in rupees will be this five divided by hundred into this is the cost price that is seven fifty. that if we solve this we will get then 5 on the 5 5 to the 10 and divide this 75 divided by 2 we will get 37.5 this will be in rupees so profit in rupees we got 37.5 so what will be the sell price sell price is equal to cost price this is the cost cost price plus profit so put this cost price is cost price is 750 cost price is not 700 because there are some overheads so total cost price will be 750 and plus profit is rupees 37.5 if we add this we will get rupees 750 plus 37 means 787 Point five. So this will be the our first answer. Means selling price of this cycle will be seven eighty seven point five rupees. Now see the B part. A lawn mower bought at rupees one one five zero with rupees fifty as a transporting charges. So here cost price for B part. Cost price will be this rupees one one. 1150 plus transportage charges 50 so total cost will be rupees 1200 here again profit of 5% is given profit profit is equal to 5% so profit in rupees will be profit in rupees will be this 5 divided by 100 into cost price is rupees 1200 so all this we will get rupees 60 rupees 60 will be the profit so sale price sale price equal to this cost price plus profit see always profit is on cost price so cost price is rupees 1200 plus profit is 60 so answer will be 1260 is the sale price this is our second answer very simple now see the c part a fan bought for rupees rupees 560 and expenses of rupees 40 made on its repair so total cost will be this rupees 560 plus expenses repair expenses are rupees 40 so total cost will be rupees 600 this is for c part and profit is 
profit is equal to 5 percent so profit in rupees profit in rupees equal to 5 divided by 100 see this is 5 percent 5 percent means rupees 5 for each 100 per 100 is rupees 5 so we have to calculate profit for rupees 600 so multiply this 5 divided by 100 into 6 100 divided by so solve this 2 0 will get cancelled and we will get rupees 30 so if we add this profit to the cost price so this is a cost price so sale price sale price equal to cost price plus profit cost price is rupees 600 plus profit is rupees 300 sorry 30 so total sale price will be rupees 630 so this will be our third answer see the question under try this section page number 123 comparing quantities class 8 mathematics question is given a shopkeeper bought two tv sets at rupees 10000 each he sold one at a profit of 10 percent and other at the loss of 10 percent find whether he made an overall profit or loss see there are two tvs what is given given is cost price of tv cost price of one tv equal to rupees 10000 so total cost price so total cost price for two tvs for two tvs will be rupees 20000 so this is given and what is one more 10 percent profit and 10 percent loss for each tv is given so a part a part let's calculate profit of 10 percent so profit in rupees profit in rupees it will be 10 divided by 100 into cost price is rupees 10,000 so that will be the 2 0 will get cancelled and that will be the 1,000 so this is a profit in rupees so sale price for first TV is equal to cost price plus profit and cost price we know it is 10,000 and profit we calculated rupees 1000 so total sale price will be rupees 11000 this is sale price for first tv now calculate the sale price for second tv for second tv there is a loss of 10 percent so calculate loss in rupees we know how to calculate percentage loss divided by 100 into cost price is 10,000 see there is 10,000 cross price again there will be the rupees 1000 loss in rupees now sale price for second TV will be cost price minus loss because there is loss loss is always subtracted from the cost price so cost price is rupees 10,000 and loss is rupees Hundred, so it will be rupees nine thousand. Sorry, cost price is ten thousand, loss is one thousand. So there will be the sale price of rupees nine thousand. So we got two sale price, eleven thousand and nine thousand. So total, so total sale price of both TVs will be rupees eleven thousand plus rupees 9000 that will be rupees 20000 and we know we have cost price of rupees 20000 sale price is also 20000 and cost price is also 20000 so our answer is there is no loss or no profit so there is no loss or no profit because sale price is equal to cost price so this is our final answer this is all for this video 
we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy thank you